Okay, I know it's been ages since I've done an update, but I've had exams and stuff, so I've been concentrating on those to get into uni next year. But here's the simplicity 4212 I've had for ages. It's actually been probably about a year since I've had it, something like that, but it's been stored. Uh, not far, but the tyres and everything are good in it. It did have a blown motor that was missing a load of parts. That's in the garage. I just need to salvage the pulley off it. I've got a spare 12 horsepower in it. The great thing about this is the steering is super tight. That's all the play there is. Deck's mostly good as well. Also, these are the parts for a wooden garage I'm going to put up. Uh, it's going to come out to about here somewhere. That'll give us lots of extra storage. Uh, over in the garage, what I've been doing lately is painting my brother's back panel. It was quite badly rusted all around here, so he decided to sand it all down and paint it. See, it's come out fairly well. New hood on the modding tractor. Uh, you can see I've also got new lights in here. I don't know if I showed you these before, but wired them all up. We only had one single incandescent bulb before and I wired all these. Only problem I did have was I needed a bigger fuse in the circuit because when all these, all six lights, there's two in each unit, tried to start up. Biffy Clyro, living is a problem because everything dies. Let's turn this music down. Sorry about that. Uh, yeah, every time I went and turned the lights on, it would trip the fuse because these take quite a bit of power to turn on. So yeah, should have more updates fairly soon. Okie doke. Ready for the top coat of paint. Got uh, makeshift ventilation. Getting paint shaken. See how it turns out. So you've got two coats of colour on it now, it's pretty close match to the rest of it. Uh, once it's sanded down and then lacquered, should look pretty close to the original. It's got some heat on it and let it dry. Don't know how well you'll see this, it looks a bit worse on the camera but the paint isn't totally matched. It's good at the top, where I could get to it properly but the bottom isn't as good. Better than it was though, kinda. So while Tom polishes that, uh, you can see the garage is actually the cleanest it's been in a long time. Uh, I'll show you this new hood I got, mainly because it has side panels so it'll keep the mud out a bit better and it's got this cool little scoop on it. Don't know, care what people say about MTDs, they do generally make quite good looking tractors. See I've had to cut it a bit to squeeze that twin in it looking good and it's kind of almost a chrome finish on it I need to polish it more that was only with I think 180 grit once I get some like thousand grit on it it will look quite cool best bit is the light works too 